G'day everyone, it's Akadaka Stacker, and yes, I've been pretty busy for the last couple of weeks. Um, reason being is by the time I get home after work and have a shower and have a cup of coffee and all that, it's dark. So, this being Saturday afternoon, I should be able to just do a catch up as to what I got throughout the week. Alright, starting on the 5th of May, I ordered when silver dipped down a little bit a two ounce mother and baby kangaroo so I scored that last Friday along with another ACDC coin So I thought I'd grab one of these and uh, not long after I got this one uh, they um, all got sold. That was quite bizarre if you ask me. Um, then on Sunday I went to Cash City and I got a bit of a thing for just collecting these I think just as collectible. Um, is that going to focus now? Uh, what these are, I found out, is polymer with the gold foil on top. An old 10 pound. And I've also got a 5 pound. Just show you the. There you go, just a something to get and yes they are very gold this light isn't very good it's gone got very dark pretty quick heading in the window the five pound got some australian stuff on there paul hereford marino u Aboriginal shields, Aboriginal boomerang, a few other things. What have we got there? Cow, Merino ram. Interesting. Yeah, that sounds. It's just gold foil. More like just some sort of collectible little thing. It'd probably look good if it was all just mounted into a picture frame so I've got those then come along um, Monday was it oh it would have been yeah on um, pretty much the same yeah Monday uh, I scored these. It was second hand, secondary market, uh, two ounce silver at Swanee's. So I managed good old Mick, picks out the good stuff for me. He got me a um, two ounce Canadian goose 2020. quite nice as a matter of fact and he got me I won't bother taking it out of the and he put this one aside got me this one two ounce piece end of world war one twenty eighteen two ounce perfect me Sweet, very good. Good old Mick, he's good at picking stuff. And then I also bought at the same time um, the very next day, it would have been the 8th, according to my ledger. I got myself a Silver Eagle 
And yes, once I got this one, and uh, good old Legacy, he got, gave me a um, proof one. I've got the just the normal pearl backed, and it does. I uh, see see now reason why you Americans actually like them. Personally, this side seems to be the side I go to. No offence. But that, when I look at it without the light around here, it's got this, uh, like a pearl, mother of pearl, sort of pearly look. Yes, so... I was wrapped about getting hold of that one. So, and in the meantime, it was the same day, I uh, went, well, I might as well get one of these, and I thought they weren't selling. So, as you would get them if you ordered them, you get a Swan Building Company, you know, gives you one of these. I got one of these, a one ounce wombat in a card. Uh, it's something like it's only two and a half thousand of them or something in a card or whatever. But these weren't selling and I thought, well, I'll get one. And uh, if they're there next week and I'll get another one. And lo and behold, same thing with this. Next time I looked on there to see if I'd grab one, they're all gone. So, I must start some sort of trend. So, good old little wombat. Coloured. Not many of them. Two and a half thousand or something. I'll give you a better look. Just a information card on the back. Come on, focus. There you go. I'll let you just pause and read that. Yes, a wombat. Um, yeah, wombat. Hmm. Eats roots, shoots, and leaves, mate. Okay. The girls like a few wombats. They eat roots, shoot and leaves. Eats roots, shoots and leaves. Go a wombat. Nice. Um, very lucky to actually pull the trigger and get one of them. Now, yes, I did. It's turned into a bit of an epic already. And, um... Just yesterday, oh, no, and in between there sometime, also, I'll have to do a separate later, I got from Snoopy Stacks, okay? So, in between that, and I've been saving it, because I actually haven't had the time to do any videos. So, I'll do a separate mail call for good old Snoopy Stacks. It feels like it sent me a, a coin in there as well. So, along with what I got, the last item that I managed to get yesterday, it actually came in, I went in to Swan and I just basically thought, well, I'll, they've got, there's nothing there, I'll just uh, fill up my wallet and, uh, you know, so, so I'll be held. So... And I uh, said to Mick, I've gone, oh, come on, Mick, you've got to have fucking something, mate. There's got to be, you've got to have that old chewed up skippy or something that's been holding the, stopping the air conditioning from rattling or the, you know, the, the coin that you jam under the door to stop it from rattling or something like this. So he's gone out and he's had a look and he's come back with this gold coin that I'm in a box. And I've gone, nah, I said, come on, what about your secret stash? Come on, you got to have something. So, and he's come out and he's holding it in his hand like it's all secret. He goes, oh, I've got you this. All right. 
and it is actually I've repackaged it because it was in this nasty and it's got all these horrible scratches on the outside it hadn't affected the bar it's just the original packaging was just uh, so I made my own out of this heated up the end of that just crimp 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 made my own so what it is it is an Australian gold silver exchange bar kangaroo with a crown around it and I'd have to admit when I first seen it I've gone oh it's Scooby Doo because I thought it was a dog collar what a muppet is that focusing in alright can I get it closer nice little 5 ounce bar with aqua style resealing yes it wasn't very um nice sitting inside of this see all the scratches on the bag so obviously it had been sitting around floating on something it hadn't affected the bar so he's pulled this out so for 200 bucks so 40 bucks a ounce not too bad thank you mick you're a champion absolutely love it he does it every time he picked me this out he picked me that out he picked this one out you know he usually pick he picks out a lot of good ones for me so thanks mick from swan there and that's about it everybody that was my weekly gets so i hope you enjoyed sorry i haven't been around busy with work etc so thanks for sticking around if you got this far and uh take care everybody thank you